Today, we're gonna to talk about burning bush, which is a common invasive shrub in the Lower Hudson Prism region. It was originally brought over to the United States in 1860 for its ornamental value. And one of the reasons why it has such an ornamental appeal is that in the fall, its leaves turn this brilliant red, which really pop out and give it that sort of like ornamental pop to it. You can't see that right now, but its other common name is winged euonymus. And you can see that as we look in a little bit closer to look at some of the key ID features as to why it's called winged. So let's take a closer look. One of the key ID features of burning bush are these corky wings that you will see all along the stems and branches of this plant. As I twist this in my hands here, you can see sometimes they come out in two different directions, sometimes four, but they almost look like little pieces of cardboard that are coming out of, uh, out of the, uh, the stems or branches of this. Um, the other thing that you can look for is if we come to the end of this, are is its leaf pattern you'll notice that the leaves do have little teeth on them so you see that they're they're the edges are not smooth but you've got like a little bit of teeth at the edge edge to them they come out to a point and they are also arranged on the stems and branches as uh in opposite so in other words one is coming out from one direction then completely op on the opposite side there's also another leaf coming off Another distinguishing characteristic of it is often people think it's like towards the end when you get to the end of this, you see how the two leaves that are coming off of it almost look like floppy bunny ears. You can see that also up here as well, almost that like floppy bunny ear look to the leaves coming off of the edge or the last leaves coming off. So that's another distinguishing feature. So again, looking for that like that cork that's coming off either in two directions and that cardboard look or in four directions or the leaf structure to it. We're filming this in the beginning of May and you can start to see that the flowers of burning bush are starting to come out. It's pretty nondescript. It's that four petals coming out of it. And right now it's got kind of a greenish, whitish hue to it. And again, looking for those that opposite leaf pattern, maybe for the flowers that are on these long stalks that are coming out, that are coming out near the, near the base of these leaves here. So that's another thing to be on the lookout for. But again, the reason why it's called winged are because of its uh, the cork that's coming off of it. Um, and burning bush because of the red fall foliage that will come in the fall, but you're not gonna be able to see that now. So this is just another profile look at the plants and what we're looking for. This is a burning bush lookalike alert. What we are looking at here is not burning bush, but in fact, it is bush honeysuckle. And if I zoom in, you can see why uh, there is some um, confusion First of all, if you see the leaves that are coming off of each of these branches here, you see how they're oppositely arranged, just like with burning bush. And it even has at the edge here, that sort of like bunny ear look to it with the pointed tip at the end as well. But here's the main difference. Bush honeysuckle, if I look closely at the leaf, if you look at the margins or the outer edge of the leaf, you see how they are smooth so with burning bush, you had the teeth at the edge or at the margins, right? So it had the tooth edge to it. Here in bush honeysuckle, it's nice and smooth. I also feel it, it feels a little hairier. You can also see that on the stem part too, right? And you can see that the flowers, which are gonna be blooming in bush honeysuckle at the end of May or maybe early June, they're, they, are, they come in pairs and the flowers are actually gonna look very different from the flowers in, bush, um, in burning bush as well. But if you wanted to know in early spring, Spring, what the differences are look at the outer edge margin with bush honeysuckle you've got the smooth margin and with burning bush you've got the teeth that are on the edges or margins of the leaves